Welcome to the John Stoltrager Show. I'm Joe Wamba, joined with head swimming coach uh, John Stoltrager. And, Coach, you guys headed out to Widener over the weekend and competed with men and women there. Uh, men's – our numbers are low, um, just in the roster size. But the women had a pretty solid performance with seven uh, qualifiers for the MAC uh, championship already. Yeah, we swam pretty well. Um, again, we're still only three weeks in – to the season so we haven't had enough time to train mm -hmm. um, to do what we really want to do but we have more qualifiers already this year on the women's side than we did all of last year and on the men's side we have as many as we did last year so it was a successful meet and uh, the opportunity to have the other two uh, male, male swimmers qualify and all the rest of the women's qualify is pretty high the uh, the team is young a lot of youth in the pool yeah we have more freshmen and sophomores than we do anything else um, and I fully anticipate the men having all five qualify. And on the women, I would anticipate having at least five, maybe six more girls qualify, which will double, over double our, our size from last year. And this meet uh, that you went up to Widener for, uh, school record already goes down in the first event with uh, a lot of youth again in the pool on the uh, women's uh, 200 free. Right. Uh, relay. Yeah, we, we broke a, a school record, which is pretty significant considering that school record is done when you're shaved and tapered at the end of the year. Mm -hmm. So to say that we have more depth and talent when our very first meet we break a school record is, is pretty important and significant. A lot of optimism coming out of the, the meet. You, the points aren't going to be there because our rosters are small. But the uh, improvement from what you were doing in preseason and what you had going last season – to this season in the very first meet has got to lead to a lot of optimism going in the future. Yeah, I think the kids even realize that we're bigger, we're better, um, we're faster. And if you look at our times from last year to this year, um, almost every event we're faster than we were last year, either with the returners that we have or with the freshmen and transfers that we brought in. And a lot of youth, like I say, I keep on saying it, youth is important. It's a, a second-year program, third-year program, um, and having a lot of qualifiers already is is important right yeah we have um again with this is only our second recruiting class mm -hmm. um we have more freshmen and sophomores again by far we only have three seniors on the girl side um no juniors on the girl side and one junior on the boy side and the rest are freshmen or sophomores so you know having them learn to swim the way i want them to swim it's important to give them time to do that and i think having you know, freshmen coming in or even transfer sophomores gives them time to figure out how to swim the races the mm -hmm. right way and how to improve. And that's the big thing with swimming is, is not always your wins and losses, but, you know, your improvement in the pool. And this week you guys have off over the weekend. Uh, a lot of opportunity to continue that improvement while you guys are practicing over the, the break or, if, or the weekend off. Right. Well, we will – yeah, there's no question that – the next meet we swim, you should see market improvement with a lot of kids because two weeks in the water is, is a ton of time, and it's just two weeks to get it aerobically stronger and, you know, be able to finish your races better than, than they did, you know, at Widener with only three weeks of practice. So, yeah, I would fully anticipate a couple school records um, and probably, you know, break another the 200 free relay record again. Well, Coach, good luck in breaking those records, and we're looking forward to – that anticipation and hopefully seeing some records uh, get broken. All right. Thank you very much. He's John Stoltrager. I'm Joe Wamba, and this has been the John Stoltrager Coaches Show.